Hi, my name is Dan Hevda, Chief Strategy Officer at Mega International. We're here today to talk about the noisy to influential journey that an enterprise architecture practice goes through. Keep in mind as we go through the stages, this is how the business or the organization perceives value from EA. So it's not an introverted look, it's really how others outside the organization perceive the work that we do. It begins with noisy. If an EA practice is new or has yet to prove or demonstrate value through usefulness, they're often seen as confused or noise. We don't know what they are, why they are, and there's no real engagement outside the EA practice. We want to transition from this as rapidly as we can, and you must go to useful. So this is one of the key tenets of the noisy to influential journey, is you have to stop at the useful stage. You cannot skip over. To be useful, we're identifying a small set of stakeholders and we're gonna push information out of the EA practice so that they consume it and they start to understand the value. So it's really kind of an outbound motion. In the trusted stages we move over, we're expanding the audience of stakeholders, we're continuing to demonstrate value. In transition, we're continuing to push information out and we're getting to the point where they start requesting more. And this is where we change over to pull. This is where you've achieved trust when they're requesting more information. And then ultimately we get to influential. And influential, this is where we've really got broad, broad recognition of value across the enterprise and the organization's collaboratively working with the enterprise architecture practice at a strategic level, setting future directions. We have a series of videos covering the transitions between each of the stages, and they'll be upcoming. If you have any questions or comments, put them in the comment section below or send me an email at dhebda at mega.com. Thank you.